Hi, I'm Michael at Omnivos Therapeutics, and this is an introduction to tuning forks. Tuning forks are typically made of aluminum or steel. I prefer aluminum tuning forks because they are lighter, they have better harmonics, and they're bigger, making them easier to hold. There are two types of tuning forks, weighted and unweighted. Unweighted tuning forks are used by the ears and around the body. Weighted tuning forks are used by the ears and on the body. Tuning forks have a stem or handle, two prongs, and a weighted tuning fork will have two round weights at the end of each prong. The weights help to create a lower octave and a stronger vibration so that it can be felt on the body. When holding a tuning fork, be sure to keep your hand and fingers relaxed. I like to rest the tuning fork on my index finger. I also keep my thumb bent. I find that helps to reduce stress in my hands. Remember to not touch the prongs as this will shorten the length of the tone. To activate an unweighted tuning fork, just tap it against something firm. Some people use a soft wood, wrapping some fabric around it. You can also tap lightly on your tibia, the bone just below your knee. I like to use a hockey puck. I keep it in my pocket to muffle the sound as I tap the tuning fork against the puck. Mallets are not good for activating a tuning fork. They're not solid enough to create a strong vibration, and using a mallet prevents you from using two more tuning forks at the same time. To activate a weighted tuning fork, just tap it against the palm of your hand, pinky side. You can use a puck, but remember, keep it in your pocket. The length of the tuning fork's tone will last depending on the quality of the aluminum and the manufacturing process, machined versus molded. I find that machined tuning forks have a more vibrant and longer lasting harmonic. The length of a tone will also depend on the frequency. Unweighted tuning forks will last 60 seconds or more. A weighted tuning fork may last between eight and 15 seconds. As the frequency gets higher, the ringtone will get shorter. The accuracy of a tuning fork can vary based on weather conditions such as temperature. The warmth of your hand could change the frequency by 0.8 Hertz, so keeping your tuning forks at room temperature is important before you start using them. The best manufacturers will guarantee a frequency to be 0.5% of what it's stated on the fork. That means that a 528 hertz tuning fork could vary by approximately 2.7 hertz. I've received calls from people who have told me that their tuning fork frequency is off, only to check it the next day and find that it was exactly correct. The main point here is if your frequency is off a little bit, don't worry, it's okay. Use it anyway because your body will know what to do with the frequency. A question I get very often is where to place a weighted tuning fork. I like to put it on joints, muscles, and nerve groups. I like to follow meridians and acupuncture points. Placing a tuning fork on the sternum and collarbone feels good, and along the spine to stimulate the organs. Do not place a weighted tuning fork near a recently broken or fractured bone. The power of sound healing with unweighted tuning forks comes from the harmonics they create. Harmonics help to create relaxation, meditation, and to calm the mind. To create harmonics with unweighted tuning forks, just tap two tuning forks together lightly, or tap lots of tuning forks together. This is why using a mallet limits what you can do. To clean your tuning forks, just wipe them down with some warm water and a soft cloth. It's important to keep your tuning forks in a place where air will circulate. Storing in a closet or a drawer may eventually lead to oxidation. This is especially important if you live near water. If you find oxidation on your tuning forks, a mildly abrasive scrub brush with some acetone should take care of it. I hope this video was helpful. If you have further questions, feel free to contact me at omnivos.com slash contact dash us. If you visit omnivos.com slash getting started, in omnivos.com slash education, you'll find more videos and a number of posts on the different products that you can purchase and how to use them.